Hello and welcome. My name is Danielle Speroni. I'm an enterprise account rep here at Red Hat. Thank you so much for joining me today. With the exciting news regarding the partnership between Red Hat and Nutanix, I figured it would be a good time to show you how easily you can deploy Nutanix's preferred enterprise Kubernetes offering, which is Red Hat's OpenShift container platform, on top of Nutanix's hyperconverged infrastructure. First things first, you'll need an AHV cluster, I have Prism loaded, and my cluster here ready to go. Next, we'll navigate to console.redhat.com. Select OpenShift from the menu. We're going to use the assisted installer, which helps automate a large part of the process. Give your OpenShift cluster a name, an address, and click Next. We'll download a single ISO, which we'll use to boot all the VMs from. With this ISO, we can upload it to the Prism Image Configuration Service. Now we'll create a set of virtual machines with just a few clicks. I'll first make an OpenShift orchestration node. These orchestration nodes are what run the core Kubernetes and OpenShift services. With that one created, we'll clone it twice for a total of three orchestration nodes. Now we'll make a few OpenShift application nodes. This set of VMs will run our application workloads on the Kubernetes platform. With all the VMs created here in Prism, all that's needed is to start them. Once the VMs have booted, they'll report into the assisted installer service, which will automate the bulk of the process. We'll give these a name and a role, and we're off to the races. The installation from this point is fully automated. After about 30 minutes, you'll have a Red Hat OpenShift cluster deployed on Nutanix's hyperconverged infrastructure. If you'd like to learn more, reach out to me or your Red Hat and Nutanix account rep to find out what OpenShift on AHV can do for you and your organization.